If your MyCloud client account includes a license for a SIP soft phone, you'll be able to make and receive calls using your PC microphone and speakers. Before you can use it, you need to enable and configure the soft phone settings. Your system administrator will provide the necessary information for you to configure the MyCloud desktop client to support this feature. Access the soft phone settings item from the configuration menu under your name. Click Enable SIP Soft Phone to activate your device. If you intend to use the SIP Soft Phone on your mobile device, also select This number is used on multiple devices. If you want to use your SIP Soft Phone when your device is not connected to the same local network as the MyCollab server, select Use Teleworker for Soft Phone and enter the IP address for the Teleworker server. I want to use my Soft Phone when I'm working from my home office so I'll select this option and enter the information provided by my system administrator, including the SIP soft phone credentials needed to connect to the server. Now with my soft phone activated, I can choose to make it my active device by selecting it from this drop-down menu. There are a variety of ways to call a contact using the MyClab desktop client. The easiest way is to simply type a name or number into the Make a Call window and hit Enter. The call rings your contact's number and a separate call window appears next to your MyCollab desktop client. If you've added a contact to a contact group, just expand the group and double-click the contact's name. The call window displays a number of call control buttons you can access during the call. Click the Hold button to place the call on hold. Click the Transfer Conference button to send the call to another number or to add another party to the call. Enter a name or number into the Transfer Conference window and select Transfer to forward the call or select Consult to create a conference call. Select the handoff button and choose another device from your ring group to push the call to that device. You could use this button to push the call to your mobile device when you need to continue the conversation on the go. Display your call history for missed, received, and dialed calls by clicking the call history icon. In addition, a missed call notification is shown across from your name in the top right hand corner. You can filter the type of calls to be displayed by selecting the tabs along the top of the call history window. Return any missed calls by right-clicking the record and selecting Call.